Welcome to Morning Prayer and Worship. This is Monday in Ordinary Time, proper 21 in the church calendar. I'm so glad that you're here. My name is Ben. You can go to benwardmusic.com slash prayer request. We'd love to pray for you. We'll set aside this time as holy. My hope is built on nothing less than Jesus' blood and righteousness. I dare not trust the sweetest frame, but only trust in Jesus' name. My hope is built on nothing less than Jesus' blood and righteousness. I dare not trust the sweetest frame, but wholly trust in Jesus' name. Christ alone, cornerstone, weak made strong in the Savior's love. Through the storm, He is Lord, Lord. darkness seems to hide his face I rest on his unchanging grace in every high and stormy gale my anchor holds within the veil my anchor holds within Christ alone, cornerstone, weak made strong in the Savior's love. Through the storm, He is Lord, Lord of all. He is Lord. Christ alone, cornerstone, weak made strong in the Savior's love. Through the storm, He is Lord, Lord of all. When He shall come, trumpet sound Oh may I then in him be found dressed in his righteousness alone faultless stand before his throne Most merciful God we confess that we have sinned against you in thought, word, and deed, by what we have done and by what we have left undone. We have not loved you with our whole heart. We have not loved our neighbors as ourselves. We are truly sorry and we humbly repent. For the sake of your Son, Jesus Christ, have mercy on us and forgive us, that we may delight in your will and walk in your ways. To the glory of your name. Amen. Christ alone cornerstone weak made strong in the Savior's love through the storm He is Lord He's the Lord of all We 
do have two prayer requests today. The first is from Mabel in Ghana. Lord, we want to pray for Mabel. She's in need of a great job since the current workplace is going out of business. Lord, we just ask you to give a job to Mabel. Oh, Lord, opportunity, divine appointment, Lord. Show her the way. Be a lamp unto her feet and a light unto her path, God. And Lord Jesus, we want to pray for her relationship with her partner. And Lord, we just want to pray with her boyfriend that, Lord, you will align their wills and that their wills will be aligned with yours. Reveal to them, Lord. In the name of Jesus, we pray for Mabel. Thank you, Lord, for her heart. Then we're going to pray for Malise in Ethiopia. So much uh, heartache because of debt, Lord. And we just pray that you, Lord, would relieve the debt in Malise's life. Lord Jesus, provide a way out, show a way out, work or gifts opportunity in the name of Jesus. Lord Malise would like to visit home, currently living in South Sudan. Lord, we just pray that you would make a way for that, even this week. May Malise have ears to hear and eyes to see how you would do that in the name of Jesus. Oh Lord, be near Malise. Thank you for what you are doing and what you are going to do in the name of Jesus. For Mabel and Malise, we lift them up today. Christ alone, cornerstone, weak made strong in the Savior's love. Through the storm, He is Lord, Lord. Psalm today is Psalm 89, 1 through 18. I will sing of the Lord's great love forever. With my mouth I will make your faithfulness known through all generations. I will declare that your love stands firm forever, that you have established your faithfulness in heaven itself. You said, I have made a covenant with my chosen one. I have sworn to David my servant. I will establish your line forever and make your throne firm through all generations. The heavens praise your wonders, Lord, your faithfulness too in the assembly of the holy ones. For who in the skies above can compare with the Lord? Who is like the Lord among the heavenly beings? In the council of the holy ones, God is greatly feared. He is more awesome than all who surround him. Who is like you, Lord God Almighty? You, Lord, are mighty and your faithfulness surrounds you. You rule over the surging sea. When its waves mount up, you still them. You crushed Rahab like one of the slain. With your strong arm, you scattered your enemies. The heavens are yours, and yours also the earth. You founded the world and all that is in it. You created the north and the south. Tabor and Hermon sing for joy at your name. Your arm is endowed with power. Your hand is strong your right hand exalted. Righteousness and justice are the foundation of your throne. Love and faithfulness go before you. Blessed are those who have learned to acclaim you, who walk in the light of your presence, Lord. They rejoice in your name all day long. They celebrate your righteousness, for you are their glory and strength. And by your favor, you exalt our horn. Indeed, our shield belongs to the Lord, our King, to the Holy One of Israel. We sing to the generations to come. We sing, we sing of your faithfulness.
Our scripture lesson today is Matthew 6, 25-34. Therefore I tell you, do not worry about your life, what you will eat or drink, or about your body, what you will wear. Is not life more than food, and the body more than clothes? Look at the birds of the air, they do not sow or reap or store away in barns, and yet your heavenly Father feeds them. Are you not much more valuable than they? Can any one of you, by worrying, add a single hour to your life? And why do you worry about clothes? See how the flowers of the field grow. They do not labor or spin. Yet I tell you that not even Solomon in all his splendor was dressed like one of these. If that is how God clothes the grass of the field, which is here today and tomorrow is thrown into the fire, will he not much more clothe you, you of little faith? So do not worry, saying, What shall we eat, or what shall we drink, or what shall we wear? For the pagans run after all these things, and your heavenly Father knows that you need them. But seek first his kingdom and his righteousness, and all these things will be given to you as well. Therefore do not worry about tomorrow. For tomorrow will worry about itself. Each day has enough troubles of its own. The word of the Lord. Thanks be to God. Thanks be to God. Amen. I believe in God the Father Almighty, Creator of heaven and earth. I believe in Jesus Christ, His only Son, our Lord. He was conceived by the power of the Holy Spirit and born of the Virgin Mary. He suffered under Pontius Pilate, was crucified, died, and was buried. He descended to the dead. On the third day He rose again. He ascended into heaven and is seated at the right hand of the Father. He will come again to judge the living and the dead. I believe in the Holy Spirit, the Holy Christian Church, the communion of saints, the forgiveness of sins, the resurrection of the body, and the life everlasting. Amen. Our Father who art in heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come, thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread, and forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not into temptation, but deliver us from evil. For thine is the kingdom and the power and the glory forever. Amen. Our collect of the day, the prayer we pray together collectively this Monday in Ordinary Time, Proper 21. O God, you declare your almighty power chiefly in showing mercy and pity. Grant us the fullness of your grace, that we, running to obtain your promises, may become partakers of your heavenly treasure through Jesus Christ our Lord, who lives and reigns with you in the Holy Spirit, one God forever and ever. Amen. You can lead us in a time of guided prayer. I'll give prompts. Pray specifically and by name for those in your life today. Let's begin with our own hearts, our joys, thanksgivings, trials, worries, fears. Lay them all before Jesus now. He cares for you.
free. Our families, our immediate families, our extended families, whatever that means in your life today. Acquaintances, co-workers, fellow students, enemies, lift them all up before the Lord now. Say their names. of our Lord Jesus Christ and the love of God and the fellowship of the Holy Spirit be with us all evermore. Amen and amen. Go in the peace and the power and the presence of the Holy Spirit. You don't have to worry because He knows what you need and He will give it to you today. Walk in that knowledge. Thank you for praying with me. Let's pray together again tomorrow. Morning Prayer and Worship is a production of Steady Stream Ministries, a 501c3 nonprofit in the United States. Thank you for your donations, monthly and one time. Go to benwardmusic.com slash donate to find out more. Bye-bye.